It's more than password, it's password plus. Our guests are Elaine Joyce and George Kapar. And here's the star of password plus. I'll kiss you if I want to. Well, it's going to be another one of those weeks. Got two good buddies here. You uh, must know. Now, Elaine, you've played Password Plus, haven't yes, you? Yes, I have. This is the first time we've got my old friend George Papard here on Password Plus. And I tell you what, from the old days, I can promise you this, it's going to be a rough week for me. He never makes it easy for me, but it's always a pleasure. Uh, would you please be excused? Would you, yes. would you mind going there and wait? No. You look very good. Thank you. I Thank am. I'm, I'm... I know you're good. Okay, you all... All right, now... He does look very good. He does, doesn't he? Look... <laughs> you noticed, huh? All right, now here's what happened. Yes, last Friday, mm -hmm. we had a very exciting game, and we had a guy who's already won once, mm -hmm. who loves to win. He's a good player. His name is Steve Mintz. I want you to meet him. Come oh, in, sure. Steve. <laughs> Okay. Now, you sit over here. And Joyce, sit there. Oh, I have to start with You just start right because you won the coin toss. Okay. The coin toss. I say it wrong. You said coin toss? Coin toss. <laughs> <laughs> I say it wrong. All right. He's here. Now, look. You know how to play it, don't yes. you? You have another $5,000 coming up. you got $8,100 so far. you got to add five to that, and you know what that is. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. Okay, ten passwords up here, beginning this time with the letter A uh -huh. and going alphabetically all the way through the letter J. You get 10 of them in 60 seconds, and you've got 5,000 more dollars. Now, remember, the first word starts with A. There, Elaine, is the first word. You got it? Yes. Okay. You're going to have 60 seconds. You ready? Ready. Go. Boat. Uh, clue. Wait. Anchor. B. Oh, uh, instrument. Uh, bassoon. Strum. Banjo. C. Uh, blackboard. Chalk. D. Uh... Dirty. A uh, clue. Plate. Dishwasher? Uh, plates. Dishes. E. Uh, simple. Easy. F. Uh, snow. Frost. One. Plate. G. Uh, history. Geography. H. Uh, sa uh, joyful. Happy. I. Uh, uh, soap. Ivory. J. Uh, stupid. A job clue. Dumb. Uh, jester. Dopey. Dunce. Drip. Idiot. Jerk. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> it is also a bird, you know. Good on a jerk, but you know about that, but you got it. You have thirteen thousand one hundred dollars. Okay, come on over. We're gonna play again. Here we go. You go over here. Here we go. You know. We got so busy getting into the end game and winning $13,000 for Steve, or Steve winning it for himself, I neglected to point out <laughs> that Steve has a wonderful occupation. He works for an importer. What do you import, Steve? The importer I work for imports pistachio nuts out of Iran. Meet Nancy Woodward. Come in, Nancy. <laughs> Yeah, two lovely ladies here, Nancy Woodward and Elaine Joyce. Nancy, tell us about yourself. I live in Marina Del Rey. I'm a photographer married to a graphic designer. All right, you ready to go? <coughs> Elaine has the option. That's the, the option. first word in the puzzle. What are you going to do, Elaine? I'll pass. Okay, George, play. Celebrated. Party. <coughs> Celebrated, he said. Second clue. Known. Famous. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Nancy. First clue in the puzzle. Give me that. First clue in the puzzle is famous. Celebrities. Is it celebrities? No, it isn't. All right, George, you've got the option. There you go. Pass or play, George. Um, play. Go. 
Um, Denmark. Copenhagen? Second clue, Elaine. Pastry. Danish. Yes. <laughs> Famous Danish. Danish. Please. Too long. All right, here we go. George has the option Ooh. again. All I could think of was You've prune. Got, you think of prune? Who has the option? <laughs> Famous prune Danish. Uh, you have the option, George. That's a play. Uh, play. Okay. <clears throat> Leprechaun? Elf. What? Elf? Oh. No. <laughs> You did that very well. Well, I could have done it better. But <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I thought you were holding back a little. All right. Uh, what did you say? He said leprechaun. Oh, you said yeah. leprechaun. Okay. Godmother. Fairy. Yes. Yeah. Fairy <laughs> godmother. All right. Famous Danish fairy. <laughs> Listen. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Guess what it is. What is the puzzle? Person, place, or thing, Nancy? No. All right. You got it at home? You got it? I have no idea. I, I don't have any idea either. There you go. Who has the... You do. I do. Yeah. Okay. Wag. Wig? No, it's not. No, that, that's right. All right, Lane. Uh, end. Tail. Tail. <laughs> We're not thinking of it. I know. All right. Here we go, Nancy. Now you got four of them. Famous Danish fairy tale. Only Danish fairy tales. Um, the silver skate, but it's not Danish. Is it the silver skate? And this is the last one. All right. George has the option. That's a play. Uh. Okay. Gonna play. Author. Writer. Right. Oh, oh, sure. Sure. Now can get all right. Now you got all five of them. Steve. Um, famous, um, famous Danish fairy tale writer. Hans Christian Andersen. Is it Hans Christian Andersen? It is. We did all the work. You did all the work. Got it. Did all the work. Good shit. No, that's the way the game works. You see, you got all four of them, but by not getting it, then they come in at the Listen, end. I would like to tell you, Alan, that I think this is a wonderful game, and I really enjoy playing it, but... The, oh, oh, here we the, go. The, the, but, but, but the you, forms you, we have to sign in order to play that game, I want to discuss with you later in the program. I want the audience to know that there's some terrible things they make us do before we're allowed to play this game. Uh, would you like to do it now before we go to commercial, just in case? No, we're going to save it up. You've got a little complaint to make. Yes, a big complaint to make. It's about You're America. <laughs> George, <laughs> American. George Picard has a complaint to make about this very program. Not the program. No, not the way it's played. It's the NBC executives, and I hope everybody writes them a letter. Oh, no, no, no. Whatever we, we, we. <laughs> uh, I am absolutely neutral. It's my job you're talking about. All right. No, it really isn't my job. Let's play the game. If you've got a complaint, Let's you may make it right after this commercial. Okay. We'll be right back. Don't go away. <laughs> Should we move ahead, or do you want to, you want to relieve us of the suspense right ahead. now? No, I want to play the game. All right, this is not about goods and top, it's not about password, it's about NBC forms. Let's, forms. But I want to play first. We want to win another one, right? All right, here we go. Let's see. You wait, can you wait? All right, here we go. Nancy has the option. Pass or play? Pass. Okay, Steve. Whistle. Uh, wind. Second clue, Nancy. Air. Blow. That's it. All right, now you got the first one. Blow. I won't care what you say. <laughs> the first clue in the puzzle is blow. Gabriel. Is it Gabriel? Oh, no, it isn't. All right. Steve has the option. You've got it. Pass the place, Steve. Pass. <laughs> <laughs> it is what I thought it was, then. No, no. God. What do you say, Natalie? <laughs> Pucker. Pucker, no. Uh, you can turn this place into a garage, you know. <laughs> um, inhale. Suck. Ah. All right, George. Oh, no. Hello. You've got it. 
got two clues. I don't know why they're doing this to me today. All right. You have two clues up there. Blow and suck. Do I have a time on this? No. Yes, you do. Oh, well, wait. Um, it's a person, place, or a thing. Is it, uh, deep throat? Is it deep throat? <laughs> I have no apologies to make. There's no case America saying America doesn't know the score. They do. All right. <laughs> Why not say it? All right. Well, you said it. I right. did, sir. Steve has the, uh, no, Nancy has the option. Has it, do you okay. wonder why I'm confused? All right. That's a play, you are. Nancy. I'll play. <laughs> Go. Cow punch. Sock. Second clue, Steve. Cow puncher. Oh. Cowboy. That's it. Oh. George, now you get the guess. You got three clues up there. Blow, suck, and cowboy. <laughs> Boy, it's... <laughs> Super Bowl. Anyone you know? Super Bowl. <laughs> Super Bowl. <laughs> All right. Nancy has the option. <sighs> Pass or play? Pass. Oh, I... Steve. Heart. Heart. Uh... Logs. Nancy, second clue. Woodsy. Fireplace. Third clue. Marshmallows. Toast. Fourth clue. Camp. Roast. Last clue for you, Steve. Oh, I see. Oh. Outdoors. Fire. Last clue for you, Nancy. Roast. Campfire. Campfire. Oh, but you said it here. Yes, you said it here. And it was allowed. It's part of the word, but you, they allow it now. Uh, Who I is that guy? Wait, wait, wait. Camp, <laughs> camp is... I didn't wait. say campfire because she said camp, and I thought the rule said you cannot use a form of the word it in the word. It used to say that. It does not say that anymore, huh? <laughs> what? It's a different word. You see, camp you have BDI. Camp, but... All right. Uh, I have very difficult. I have great difficulty defending that uh, ruling, but I don't have to. All right. You have the option: blow, suck, cowboy, and campfire. Not the option. You get to guess the, the puzzle. Oh. Is this barbecue? Is it barbecue? No. All right. Now, you is this always a person or a, a place? place or a thing? A person, a place, or a thing? A person, a place, or That's a thing? That's what the puzzle is. <laughs> All right, how about you in the audience? Do you have it? No. Yes, they don't have it. Do you have it at home? Better. Okay, we're all together. We're all in the dark. <sighs> Steve has the option. Pass or play? I'll play. Okay. Musical instrument. All right. Good. You got the fifth and last clue. Now, you get to guess the puzzle. There are five clues up there as to this person, place, or thing. They are blow, suck, cowboy, campfire, instrument. Bellows. Is it a bellows? No. no. All right, Steve, no, since this is the fifth one, oh. you get to try it. What is it's it? It's a harmonica or a mouth organ. Is it a harmonica or a mouth organ? Yes. Yeah. 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 All right. You play it, cowboys play it by going in and blowing out. And they play it around a campfire, and it is a musical instrument. We have a commercial. We'll be right back. Don't go away. Yeah. Okay, now wait, wait a minute, now wait one minute. I think that I should do, would you like me to complain some more about No, 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 I'd like you to explain your complaint. Don't complain anymore, just explain. All right, well here's the thing, friends. I think you should know that before we do this program, that is the, the, uh, I, did they make you sign that form too? I don't know what form you mean. All right, well there's a form that says that you won't cheat, you won't steal, you won't kick your mother, you won't tell anybody, you're not getting any prizes, it goes on and on and on like you were some crook. Well, now, it is really uh, unnecessary in this game. I mean, everybody around this game is paranoid about the truth. They're very careful. Uh, and we even have somebody from NBC who watches us. Now, that gets into the police state mentality, and I do not think it's necessary. And I personally resent it, Mr. Silverman and the rest of you. Would you all write him a letter and tell him to stop that? This is America. Everybody has a right to his opinion. There is, though, this very important fact to remember. 
When you watch game shows today, you are now assured that what you see is what you get. I mean, there is no hanky-panky. There is no planning. There is no arrangement. There is no way. Because all of the networks, all of the networks, very carefully supervise their games. The fact that NBC elects to have a form offends some people. But it is true that game shows are militantly uh, uh, supervised by the networks. And for that, all of us in the game show business are really grateful because we can... That part's say, all right. It's true, it's straight, there's no cheating. Okay, we have a commercial. I yet. have to leave because there's no cheating. <laughs> <laughs> well, in, in some regard. Uh, we'll talk right through that, so we'll go to a commercial, then we'll come back and play the $200 puzzle, okay? Ooh. Don't go away. This has to be a drink. This is $200 puzzle. You get it, you win the game. If you get it, you tie the game up. Elaine has the option. You've got the word. There it is. Pass or play, Elaine. I'll play. Go. B. <laughs> yes. Nancy. First clue of the puzzle is buzz. Buzz. What do you think? A doorbell. Is it a doorbell? <laughs> no, it isn't. All right. George has the option. You got it. Pass or play, George. Uh, pass. Elaine. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, thorny. Prickly. Yeah. You accept it. Yeah. All right. <laughs> the word is prickly. <laughs> but it's a form of the word, meaning the same thing. Pricker, buzz, pricker. That's a good, good clue. Thank you very much. Uh, bees. Is it a bee? Or bees? Oh, the other two is a manufacturer of honey and things. Oh, All right. I can't believe it. Now you got 200 to 200. Whoever wins this puzzle uh, wins the game. This is for the game. Steve has the option. What are you going to do, Steve? Pass or play? This is the $200 puzzle. This will do it. I'll play. Go. Vertebrate. Mammal. Second clue, Nancy. Beast. Skeleton. Third clue, Steve. General. Um, um. Dragon. Fourth clue, Nancy. Generic. Dinosaur. Fifth and last clue, Steve. Pet. Spine. Sixth and last clue. Mm. Vegetable. In time, vegetable, right? You may respond. No. <laughs> Animal. Yes. Oh! He's a vertebrate. Well, vertebrate. You see, it, it's funny how that first clue kind of put them off. It was a very precise clue, vertebrate, actually. All right. Animal was the first animal, clue in the puzzle. You get to guess it. It's for the mm -hmm. game, Elaine. Very good. First clue is animal. What do you think? Um, Sesame Street. Is it Sesame Street? Mm. No. Steve has the option again. You've got it at home. Pass or play, Steve. I'll play. Go. Autumn. Fall. Second clue, Nancy. Snowy. Winter. That's it. Now you got two up there. Animal. Winter. What do you think it is? I think it's a uh, bear. Is it a bear? No, it's not. Steve has the option again. You've got it at home. Pass or play, Steve? Pass. Nessie. Image. Mirror. Second clue, Steve. Oh. Uh -huh. Dark. Um, shadow. Yes! I know what it is. I know what it is. George, you've got three clues up there. This is for the game. Animal, oh. winter, shadow. Oh. What is it? It's the little animal that comes out of the ground in the spring. If you see his shadow, it's going to be... What is what it? It is a... Not a hedgehog. Is it a hedgehog? It's not a hedgehog. Is it a hedgehog? Does he get to guess? No. Oh. He doesn't? Too late. All right. Okay. You uh, lined it up. All right, here we go. Nancy has the, the option. Pass or play, Nancy? Play. Go. Climate. Temperature. Second clue, Steve. Meteorology. Uh, spring. 
Third clue. Report. What, what you report? Report. Uh. Fourth clue, Steve. Meteorology. Weather. Yeah, oh, there. Yeah. Now you got four clues. He still can't help you. He still can't help. This is for the game. Animal. Winter. Shadow. Weather. Groundhog. Yeah. yeah. Is it a groundhog? Oh, sorry, I couldn't think of weather. Is it a groundhog? Oh, yeah. You won the game. You have two hundred dollars. You can oh, play. play. Yeah. We have a commercial. We'll be back to play the alphabetics right after this. Don't go away. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Have a good day. Surprise! It's fabulous in every sense of the word. I get that all the time. The secret's out, and the critics agree. I've got a secret. It's the hottest game show on television. It'd be worth it if you had to pay to get in. <laughs> I've got a secret. Tonight at 11.30, only on GSN. Fabulous! GSN.